Welcome to our kitchen. My name's Tracy. I'm Tanina. And welcome to today's midweek cooking, which really isn't well, midweek at all. Yes. Oh, yeah. Well, well it is our midweek. It It'll is do. our midweek cooking, but we've done a it's very a week. special <laughs> chocolate mousse for Easter. And Tanina and I, because we both have got red hair, we thought we'd cook together. Yeah, well, oh, no, why and we, not? we also like chocolate. We do. We've got a few of the favourite things, uh, the same favourite things. We have yep. lots of the same favourite things. So we're quite good buddies just vicariously through chocolate and salt and olive oil and yes. vanilla and stuff like that. Chocolate so makes good friends though, doesn't uh, it? Yeah, yeah, we like this. Always. We yeah. like this. Yeah. So today we're going to show you how to make a triple layer chocolate mousse. Are you ready for it? With either. In it. Yeah, with yeah. extra virgin olive oil, which is a bit strange, but we've been eating the chocolate mousse just a little bit this morning, <laughs> just checking on the flavours and the texture, and it's absolutely amazing. So Tanine is going to do a gold caramel layer for the mousse. Yep. Um, oh, the and by the way, oh, by the way, we've got to tell them, if you want to speak to us, everyone out there in Facebook land who are watching, go just for write it. A comment. Yeah. Yeah. Write a comment, thumbs up, give us a wave. Um, it's fantastic to know that, that there are people out there listening to we us while so, we're anyway. chattering That's away. Right. We love talking, showing you but chocolate. We like to talk to somebody. Yeah, it's really yeah. nice so to have a question. Ask, ask any question yeah. you want. Yeah. Ma mainly about cooking, it's really good. Yeah. So, Tanine is going to use, you're going to use a gold caramel. I am. Yeah. And how are you going to be cooking? Cooking so this one. because we've got an induction stove here, um, you can actually melt chocolate on an induction stove very easily. Uh, but because we're putting olive oil and milk in with this chocolate, mm. it's going to be pretty well good on any stove on a very low heat. Potentially, maybe not gas. Actually, you've got a bit less control of the flames. You up can't the side go to the pub so while you're making this in the middle of no. making this. So we've got our. And I'm just. Yeah, can I just on. quickly tell yeah. them because I can co start cooling okay. mine down as yeah, well you at do the that. same time. So we're, we're sort of. This really is super live because I've got the 55%. Um, uh, now, what did you call it? Dark milk. Dark milk. Yeah. Dark milk chocolate with a um, shot of espresso coffee yeah so I'm just mixing that around I'm going to take that off the heat and we're going to actually put some of the beautiful rose uh, ruby ruby I keep calling it rose ruby chocolate on the top there yep. to just melt because we're going to do little flakes on the top of our mousse of course we are because why wouldn't you if you can <laughs> moving over here so I've just put 60 mils of extra virgin olive oil in with the chocolate and the milk and I'm going to add in some vanilla as well some hey la la which is my favorite everybody knows that I would normally pour that whole jar in but I'm behaving myself <laughs> on camera I would too you know when it says one <laughs> teaspoon I'd be like yeah two. Oh, yeah I, I go through it. this stuff it's ridiculous um it is delicious because it's made from pure vanilla beans it's not their story no is so great as I well love isn't it story mm. yeah i'm just going to turn this on really slowly okay, i'm also going to add a pinch of the pink salt flakes and um this also has a great story doesn't it these are from the sort of the border of south australia and well it's a, sort of a three three part border isn't well, it, it Victoria, is really because it's New all South the murray Wales. river darling yes. um basin. Uh, underground aquifer basin yes. thing isn't so it's it? totally pure um like us <laughs> absolutely so now we're going to stir that and just let it come together while it melts and i might just turn it up a bit because it seems to be is it working for me does it oh it i'm will. on the wrong thing oh again so Tanina's trying to use the induction uh, that's off and with yep. the pan. That's so, but yeah. that's cool. That's cool. Okay. It'll all come together. So while you're doing that and waiting for your pan to heat up on the right, on the right um, induction, I, I have. Like we've, we're doing two different uh, chocolate mousse recipes because both of them had olive oil in. So Tanina sent me hers, and I've sent her mine. And um, so Tanina's doing the version with no added sugar. Yes, yeah, so it's the diet version, really. Yeah. If you think of it like that. It's well, mine's the, the low-fat version no without version. dairy or without yeah. cream in it. I should say we were la laughing about it earlier on, weren't we? Because yours. Yeah. It's got no sugar in it. Well, it's got the no, sugar from the chocolate. I know, no added sugar. No added sugar. Just what's in the chocolate. Yeah. And mine's got no added cream, but the chocolate does have a little bit of milk in. So I know I've put it up on the website right now saying dairy-free, mm. but it's not really. But if you use the 70%, 
yes. you would have a dairy-free mousse. It would kind of knock your socks off because it would be very, very dark. But it, it would be dark, but you've got sh you've got a bit of sugar yeah, in mine. Yeah. So I think that, that helps. I've made it with seventy yeah. percent before, yeah. and as long as you're a grown-up chocolate person and you love that yes. chocolatey flavour like that, and that's why I put a bit of mocha in mm. it as well, or made it mocha with a shot of coffee or forty. It's about forty mils of yep. espresso. Actually, mine? did you see in the West Australian there was a story about dark chocolate helping you have a better memory? Um, you, I can't you, remember. No, me either. <laughs> <laughs> I, did I steal your line then? Yes. I'm she, sorry. She's trying my jokes. She's got my I'm hair. So she's got my jokes. Yeah. <laughs> I was going to repeat myself and say it oh. again. <laughs> a bit further on. We've got to remember our song. By oh, the way. we're not going to yeah, do it now. I don't know now. if I remember Sorry, that. I need I'm more dark chocolate now. in my life. Um, so <laughs> we've got this very um, beautiful, shiny uh, chocolate here, which is sort of cooled down a little bit. I've whisked my egg yolks. So we're using the um, fabulous syrup. I, I said to Tina, you should always take whisks. <laughs> take whisks. Take more whisks. Oh, is that what I said? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, take more whisks. Oh, my God. Dad <laughs> jokes are starting now. Um, so we've got the beautiful pastured eggs from Charcoal Springs. And I was saying to Tanina, it's so <laughs> beautiful when you know where every single Literally. item, every single ingredient yeah. in this chocolate mousse, we know where it comes from. Um, some of them we know the farmers, Bannister Downs, Charcoal Springs. You've been to, have you been to Calibre? I've, I've been to Ghana She's and seen, seen it from the ground up. You've yeah. been to Cobram Estate. Yes. And you've been to Murray River Salt. I have. Yeah, played on the salt flats. I haven't at all, but mm. I have been to Byron Oh, Bay. this is melted. This okay, so I, and I'm going to do this because otherwise all of a sudden it, it won't work. So I'm going to add the chocolate, the warm-ish chocolate, into my egg yolks I know you didn't want sugar. me to lick this, but is there another clean one? Do you want to <laughs> lick it? You can lick it. <laughs> no, I'm not going to lick it. You can it. lick it. I'll turn okay. that off. It's this is done, so we just need to... Sure. I'll bring that around, yeah? So, and going to move this that's done move this over here and get this whisked up as well oh. and now so we'll turn that it upside yeah. down oh careful oh yeah there's a knife in there oh, i was going to take that little bit off uh, so live oh. we can't do it no yeah. just do it in we'll here we'll just do it we'll just do it like that but we'll put it onto the onto the non if bit. you hold that i'll okay. get a scraper okay put it onto the non labely bit See, and this is what's so beautiful about so that's cooking really together good. with friends, isn't it? That one person can hold the bowl and the <laughs> other person can <laughs> scrape. <laughs> That'll do, won't it? All right. And yeah. uh, the cameraman's saying something to us, but I can't really hear. All right. So that is the ruby chocolate, and we're going to... Can't hear, cameraman. Oh, I'm out of shot. That's because you pushed that out of my way. Oh, you, okay. You, you crowded the bench. I, I'd never do that on purpose. I'm you know sure that. you wouldn't. There we go. All right. Look okay. at that. I could Done. eat that like that, actually. Look. Oh, fabulous. Oh, my God. Look at that. Face Ooh. cream. <laughs> um, so I'm just going to check my, I'm just gonna check my uh, recipe because we've got two different recipes. We've been talking about both recipes. When, you're, when you feel that you're so together with somebody else, it, you, it, you can almost feel like you're that person. So the I just synergy. don't want to start making your mousse by mistake. No, so true. I'm going to add the olive oil to this. Now this, my one's got more chocolate in it. I just love that. Look how slowly, how slowly it's coming off yes. that whisk. I don't know. The cameraman can capture that, but anyway, uh, that's very beautiful. And I'm going to start adding the olive Should oil. I stand back. You could possibly I did bring a little a spare bit. Shirt, but yeah, it does. It does take a little while to mm. actually decide to become can they friends. See that? Doesn't you want to put that under? Can you see that, Mr. Cameraman? Yes. Yeah. So it sort of splits a little bit, but you should expect that. Don't panic. It does and a little bit until going. it sort of starts. Yeah. Going. Oh, okay. So that's really quite nice. Now, do you want to talk about the why we use this? particular cobram olive oil the oh, light the, one yes so when it says light it doesn't mean low calorie or low fat it actually got less olivey sort of uh, overtones to be honest i quite like the stronger flavors specifically with the dark uh, with the dark chocolate i think it tastes it really they match very well mm. they pair very mm. well 
But if you use the light one, this is great for, for um, mayonnaise, mayonnaise and so on as well, where you don't want that really strong olive taste that will sort of infuse through everything. Um, and of course, it's perfect for mousse because you, it's actually about the texture more than about the flavour. Yeah, oh, definitely. For, it just adds a beautiful I lightness I find with to this mousse. one, before I tried your one, though, this one I could definitely taste that there was an olivey flavour in. But as you yeah. say, it's so yummy and it makes mm. people go, what is in this mousse? It's incredible. Do we have a question? We've got one of our production team. <laughs> no, not yet. Can we? Yes, it came out of the freezer, Natalie. Yes, just, uh, Nat, we just did that to... Uh, make sure, actually, we should really put that back in the freezer. Yeah, maybe. Just, or in, yeah. the fridge. in the fridge. Yeah. Fridge. In the fridge. Just to cool that down a little bit. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, just to cool that down a little bit. We'll, uh, we'll answer all the other questions towards the end. Um, and then everyone's questions will be answered. So, yeah, and that's just, it. It's sort of, and I you're cooling yours down. Yeah, I'm just cooling this mix before I add whipped cream in. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, at home. <laughs> yeah. Um, All right. You should so, really put it oh in plastic. My Lord. But, you know. Now, that oh, to me wow. is just. Uh, Isn't that beautiful? Luscious, that, that's a, that's actually an Instagram photo right there, don't it's you think? Of, I can't really get it at the right angle. Can I? Can you see that? That's beautiful. That's just like, oh my, look at the gloss on it. I can't stop looking at it, actually. Just spend a mindful moment. Photo. Oh, you want to look at it again? Photo what? Oh, you want to I lick? Know. They're naughty, aren't they? You <laughs> never, <laughs> never must lick as you go. Why not? Oh, okay. You can at home. <laughs> Come on. Okay. So, with that, I'm just going to set that aside. And now, I've totally lost. Oh, here they are. So, now I have the egg whites. See? So, mine would be too heavy just like that, wouldn't it? And you're going to put cream in yours yep. for um, everyone to get... Um, oh, I didn't put my vanilla in. We'll oh, put it in you put it here. Do you want that? Um, my, so yours is for bones and teeth. Yours <laughs> is for strength of bones and teeth. And mine is for... Antioxidants. Antioxidants. So that you remember better. Because <laughs> <laughs> they help your memory. That's, That's right. the one. So we'll whisk this up. Memory. So we've used That's the... That's the best excuse I ever heard for eating chocolate. Antioxidants no, for memory. For, for memory. Yeah, as long as to we can protect remember your it. memory. Chocolate every day. Dark chocolate every day, guys. It's a health food. I've been saying it for years. I know you have. Finally. I know you have. I have Finally. The, the support, the scientific research behind me. So I'm going to put the teaspoon and a bit of Hey La La vanilla into there. It's still super warm. But I think it's going to be okay. Are you, you want to keep it warm? No, I'm trying to oh, cool okay. it. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's okay. If I finish mine before yours, don't worry about okay. it. Okay. It'll be okay. All right. Like, it's what a competition? Race. It is a race. Come on. <laughs> a moose race. What competition? Moose's race. What's the plural right. of moose? I want to know. Moose eye? The plural of moose? Yeah. Mooses? Moosey. Moose eye? I've just got my little stick I'll pizza. stop it. All right. All right. Let's stop your little perfect and whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to fold this in now to my chocolate mixture. Um, I'm going to put this under here because it's really in the way, isn't it? But while I'm folding in underneath the camera, yes. While I'm folding in underneath the camera, I've got my... <laughs> I just don't want this to seize too much because it's quite cool in here as well, isn't it? Or is it just us? No, we're hot. It's cool. We're so hot. <laughs> Does anyone see that? No, mm -hmm. I missed it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Never ever lick anything as you're going on. So I'm going to fold in the first lot of my egg. Now, don't worry too much about this, as in folding it in and trying to keep the um, air in it, because it will be completely impossible to keep any air in this. So what you're doing is when you're folding in two different mixes, you always fold in the light mix into the heavy mix first to lighten that up, and then you put the rest of it in. If I was to plonk this heavy chocolate mixture into those egg whites, what your mouth's watering, isn't it? I know. 
<laughs> well, that chocolate taste is so good. Extra swallowing. Um, <laughs> if I was to add this chocolate into the um, whisked up egg whites, which are very light and dainty and delicate, then it would just, all that um, air would just collapse out mm. of it. Did I have a, um, yes I did. So I'm just going to scrape the rest of that into here. Well, it's interesting, isn't it, seeing how, which, and I didn't even think about this when we were, you know, talking about it, which mousse could be made first. If I was on MasterChef, would I win? No. <laughs> it's not all about time, is it? Not always, no. No. No, no, I, I don't know. watch MasterChef, so I don't really know. <laughs> I've got no but, idea. But um, I, I was thinking about this mousse this morning. I don't know whether you were, Tanina, when you woke up. Oh. <laughs> I dream of mousse all the time. <laughs> <Do you? Tracy. laughs> and I was thinking um, how I would absolutely love to know whether you make this over Easter or at any time, because I think it's such an interesting combination mm, of mm. flavors in here and to make a I know a, a olive oil mousse has been around for a while like mm. we haven't just made this up but it's one of those things that you sort of tend to forget when you're actually making it and I think this makes the most divinely fudgy chocolate mousse yeah the dark one is very fudgy isn't mm. it really this fudgy. is lighter this version yeah um I think the, ol the olive oil adds an extra sort of oh element of God. texture that you sometimes miss with other mousse Moussai. Yeah. <laughs> Other mousse so recipes. Yeah, yeah I think, uh, you know, mousse is always a pretty easy dessert. That's a bit out of the 70s, isn't it? You know, like. Well, it is, isn't but, it? But, but I it's love so it. classic. Why? It's beautiful. Who, it's, wh we, when we went away it? on our tour to Southern Forest a couple of weeks ago, everywhere we went in the Southern Forest, we had amazing food down yeah. in Pemberton and Manjumup. But literally on every menu, there was chocolate mousse. And wow. we did laugh as we were eating That's it before we were hey? eating it after yeah there are a lot of chocolate mousses it's down coming there. back so Making i reckon it is coming back yeah. and now we've actually seen why the did deal. it ever leave it didn't leave my kitchen okay oh i'm no, going to fold this either. here okay over so here so you can one. see so yeah. under the camera just to finish <laughs> just to finish mine off we've got um some pre-whipped cream um and that's been in the fridge so it's it's quite stiff which is good so we're just going to put a bit of that into here. I'm going to have fold a look it at the through. Ruby. The ruby doobie. And that's all you're doing, basically. And again, the cream is lighter than the chocolate. So you add that in on top. And it, it loosens that mixture up quite quickly. You can see that. But it will set. Um, oh, wow. Look at that solid i don't know did you put that little knife somewhere i put it in the sink probably <laughs> okay i tried not to lick it no i just i actually got it because it was so, so many of our knives are a bit old and i don't know whether they'll flake with these oh ones. right anyway, okay. don't worry about that that's fine and then you finally Excuse just do the last there. little bit and that's there we go. that's it just fold it in and it's super easy so if you if you're a thermomix person you can do this first okay. part in your Thermomix and that's my recipe will probably reflect that. Our, our ruby chocolate is not quite Isn't it? Not set. quite hard enough. That's okay. We can we can just wait for that. I'll just All right. clear up. So there you go. And you know what? I'd be putting just a little bit of salt flakes on this if oh I had it gosh, by itself. Oh my gosh, we didn't put our salt in it. I did. I did. I did. I did Murray River salt flakes. <laughs> I remembered. <laughs> I didn't, but I'll oh, now hold the tin. How good is that? Like mm. that. Murray River salt Have flakes a taste make a massive. Oh, go on. <laughs> go on. Mm. That is so Isn't good. that awesome? That this yeah. is incredible. I know. Is it I not? love it. Absolutely this incredible. is not salty. It's got a, s a hint of salt in it, which I learnt about. They've got a. They've got another. A Calibre have another brand that's got salt. Um, oh, now she's trying hard, isn't she? Yeah, look. <laughs> there we are. That, that would be a nice little crunchy element Wouldn't it? too. Yeah. Um, but they yeah, have one called <laughs> Zephyr that is salty, but oh, this okay. one is not so, uh, not as salty, so adding salt's fine. And you get so that salty caramel. Salt flakes on chocolate. Salt. <laughs>
of, do you remember the words? No, we, we practiced this. We really I didn't eat any dark chocolate today. We're really good at singing. Salt flakes, flakes on chocolate, chocolate and evu and no, no, vanilla. Vanilla. Vanilla evu. Uh, olive oil. Oh. You've got to pause. You can see why Salt we're not in. Salt flakes on chocolate and vanilla, olive oil. This is why we're here in Perth. These are a few of our not on favourite things. I've never <laughs> sung. Before. I'm really hopeless at singing, everyone. So I apologise about that. But it's I'm the lyrics. Sure it's the lyrics. Blame it is, the lyrics. It's all about the lyrics. <laughs> but these are a few of our favourite things, and this is why we just get so excited about all of this because it's really lovely. But joking aside, salt and chocolate, amazing. Yeah, Have you ever yeah. tried? Uh, Parmesan cheese and chocolate. Seventy percent Parmesan you told cheese. Me that. I did. Yeah. Amazing. Seventy percent Parmesan cheese. Seventy percent Parmesan cheese. No. And really oh. good chocolate. No. Oh really? Seventy <laughs> percent dark chocolate and really good Parmesan cheese. Yes. And um, it's incredible together. Mm. Incredible. In fact, that was European Foods, Catherine Natali. Ah right. Actually, okay. I was in Melbourne with Cobram, and yep. um, they had toasted sourdough with chocolate melted chocolate and pink salt flakes and olive oil drizzled over the top. And so that was remarkable. That was a dessert with Ian Curley, actually. Brilliant. Yeah. So that everyone can go around singing our song about I know, right? a few of All our favourite things. Yeah, what's so missing? if you want to send mm. us in if you want to send us in your rendition of the song, please do. We Or better lyrics. <laughs> we I like the lyrics. This is a tune that I can't get into. So what we're okay. going to do is just before we try and do these lovely little ruby chocolate flakes. To show what we did earlier. To show what we did earlier. Okay. So obviously when you're making layered mousse, mousse eye, <laughs> like this. Mousses. Mousses. Did you look it up? Yeah. It's mousse mousses eye. officially. Is it mousses? Oh. Is it? Okay. Mousse eye is so funny. Um, <laughs> <laughs> we've got, we've layered it up in our um, lovely glasses. Which this so one glass will feed the entire <laughs> family. <laughs> Just so you know, it's bigger than my face. <laughs> <laughs> so what we've done, as I've said, it makes six huge chocolate <laughs> mousses. Yeah. Okay, so we've got the dark on the bottom that you can make to Nina's way with the added calcium, with the yes. cream. You can make the gold, which is the caramel. Your with that way? No, no. Oh. let's just go all oh. of them your way. Oh, okay. Yours all of the, I, my yours way is, or the highway? Yeah, yours is better. Okay. <laughs> to Nina's way is more versatile whereas uh the chocolate mousse with the all of the olive oil and no cream has to be made with a dark chocolate yep. it cannot be made with a it milkier chocolate mm. it just won't hold all of that mm. olive oil not as nice okay. it just doesn't work yep. it'll just split and not come back together again or too scary to even try actually, yeah i yeah. thought it would be quite strong too actually yes. it'd be really yes yeah. so it'd be too strong with the mm. olive oil so all of the layers make as Tanina's made them, and I've put the recipe up on the page so that you can see. You just put a different Three chocolate Three recipes in for, each the time. for the price of one. Yeah, and then yeah. there's my chocolate mousse recipe with more olive oil, less cream, or no cream, and you can make that only with the dark chocolate. All right? Mm. But you don't have to make all three layers. They can make one. Yeah. Or they can make two. But if you make all three, use a smaller glass. So it says it makes six huge or... 24 normal. 24 normal <laughs> sizes. Probably about 12, yeah. I reckon. This 12. would be perfect for your Easter brunch. You know, when you've got all the adults there, the kids Absolutely have done is. the Easter hunt. I'm going to see whether this is doable Full now. 25 of these. Are I think I should have thinned it out a little bit more. Yeah, it's a little so when cane. you, when you, uh, uh, if you want to make your ruby curls, can we see that in the above camera? When you want to make your ruby curls, because we were talking about tempering, weren't we? And we were like, oh. We didn't temper. Not really. Here we go. So just a, oh thanks, have a friend and a, and a tight tummy, you know, like Elle McPherson's tummy, that sort of one to hold your tin together. And you can make these beautiful little ruby flakes yeah. like that. Yeah. How sweet is Pretty that? Better very, than very sweet. Yeah. Mm. So we're going to have a try? I guess so. Look, it's <gasps> kind it's of a rule. Oh, oh, and I did just put a little bit of this on the top, the um, fresh as raspberry powder. Yep. And last thing. Because we went, the, yeah, we went to the uh, Berry Sweet Farm down in Southern Forest. Amazing. Mm. So, like hardly any sprays, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Like they do best farm practices. Yep. Amazing. So we could eat the berries off the bush, which was really nice. So mm. they get sold in the supermarkets as Driscoll's okay. berries. And they come from WA. Really, really good. Okay. So we're going to dig into we're gonna this. We're going to ruin one. I'm going to go right down we'll to the bottom. One. 
there's, there's, I can see the whites of the crew's eyes. They're just dying to get into this. So we'll save you some, guys. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Can you get oh. right down to the... Oh, look, you've got know. added vitamin I did. C. I got, I got added all... Added vitamin C. Yeah, at the top with, mm. The, mm. with the raspberry. Just watch. Mm. Can I get that all in? Mm. Mm, it's good, isn't it? That's so good. With the raspberry. Well, that is really good. Oh, yeah. And I just got the... You get all the Caramel different textures layer. as well. Mm. Mm. A little bit of Absolutely salt, fantastic. a lot of vanilla. Absolutely fantastic. So not I sure I liked it. I'm just Enjoy. checking. <laughs> no double dipping. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Mm. So, have we got any questions while we're eating? It's this? okay. I think this is not bad. Yeah. So, from all right. of taste, just a few comments. Um, oh, comments. Comments. Jenny Farmer says the West Australian also reported that it lowers blood pressure. Has to be ninety percent though. Ninety oh. percent. Jenny, Jenny, stop it. You just ruined my day. Yeah. <laughs> 70 is close to 90, though, isn't it? Must yeah. lower it a bit. Jenny 90 was the one who also told us moose or mooses, both are plural. <laughs> <laughs> moose. Yeah. The moose. The moose, these moose. These moose. Yes. Those. Our moose, Ruby your moose. moose I tried Ruby Moose Natalie Cream, interestingly. <laughs> and. Um, it's yummy, but it's not pink. It sort of loses the pinkness, which was a little bit mm. disappointing. And I ended up putting some of this in, actually, to try and lift okay. the colour. But it, it And this is I'm why not, we're saying that, do the curls. It. Yeah. Use it perhaps a bit more, more yeah. like that, because when yeah. you heat it, it does it, it, tend to lose It is naturally bit. that colour, um, but the heat does mess with it a little bit. Um, you have to be very cautious with it. it melt, it's got a different tempering temperature than the other chocolates as well. Um, so you take it up to slightly lower and you bring it down to lower, you know, to temper it. Mm. And so you need to be a little bit... You've got to have a bit of technical yeah, A little bit of chocolate knowledge, know -how. Which is why mm. we did this. Mm. Awesome. <laughs> Wonderful. Anything else? Um, we've got a few hi's to Tamina and um, Alison, <laughs> Hi, guys. Who's coming Do to Bali? I, I think some of them are coming oh, to Bali. Are they? Mm. Oh, we're Alison, Michelle, Leanne, they're your mates. Yeah. Alison yeah. Fleming said that she doesn't like dark chocolate, that's why her memory is not so good. Oh, oh Alison, I think you need to try harder. Yeah. <laughs> Develop the Eat taste dark for chocolate it. with eggs and yeah, you know, cream. Yeah, you put other it. things with it, it's fantastic. <laughs> yeah, that's right. There's also a people Good recommendations oh. for cheese pairings. With chocolate. And chocolate. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Oh, right. Same, same. See, yeah, cheese yeah. and jam, cheese yeah. and honey. Yeah. I mean, look at cheese blue and cheese beautiful. and honey. Oh, yeah, it's amazing. Yeah. Amazing. And, the J and Jane Smith, good on you, Jane, Jane Smith. Yes, yeah. totally. The raspberries yeah. make it healthy. Vitamin C, added vitamin yes. C. Yes. Yes. Um, back to Natalie Cream. She's made ruby chocolates. Yes. Ah. And how'd you go, Natalie Cream? How did oh. she go? Yeah. How did you go, Nat? Oh, she's I'm not chatting with she, you. No, she's not I know, but she might just start <laughs> typing if she's still there. She might have gone. There's always gone. one. Natalie was a bit noisy on Saturday, I've I seen. might say. I know. I love <laughs> Nat. She's lovely. I can't stop eating this. I haven't had any lunch. Well, no, no we haven't ever. Time. It's lunchtime. Yeah, time. did you make me lunch? Mm. Yeah. I did come all this way. Leftovers you got. Oh, cool. Mm. I'm going so as well. Any other questions? We're good. I think we're we're all okay. Oh, Natalie mm. said it went great. Oh, I knew she danced. I her. think you put po pictures up, and it was nice and nice and pink. So, Fantastic. did you use the Thermomix? Because I did it. I don't use the Thermomix for okay. melting ruby. It's mm. just it just kills yeah. the colour. So maybe Natalie needs hot. to come in and do a guest present. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, can <laughs> I come? How to use ruby <laughs> chocolate? And we'll both be there, Nat. So thank you to everyone who um, has been watching today. It's been great fun with Tanina. There's three left to go. Three and a half to go. Do you reckon we'll make it? Totally. Oh, no, they're going <laughs> to eat them. They're going to eat them. Huge chocolate mousses. So enjoy the recipe. Um, recipes. And you've got three. Three recipes. Yeah, absolutely. Like and uh, remember to turn your notifications on for Facebook, both on Cooking Cook with Tanina. Tanina. And matters of taste, so that you get and you've got to comment about and going like live. things. Otherwise, I know. you won't see it. That's so right. If and it, it doesn't come awful. up in your feed. You miss out. So yeah, you miss yeah. out on all this Make sure you comment. stuff. So have a fantastic uh, Easter. And the cameraman's looking at me. 
And at two o'clock, oh, two o'clock, back together. Yeah. So but we're coming we back together promise. for <laughs> our insiders club. Uh, I might for our insiders <laughs> Tanina's insiders club and the Cooks Collective mm -hmm. uh, online membership as well. We're live streaming to our <laughs> live our streaming groups. to our members. Yes, correct. <laughs> oh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> La That's it. <laughs> Can you hear Brian? <laughs> live streaming. <laughs> live streaming to our groups yes um at two o'clock and we're talking about food positivity which mm. is quite a serious subject but probably one that it most of us can be that funny relate i mean it won't be that serious it won't be that serious. well i <laughs> said it, it, it it's a serious subject actually both uh, mm. both of us feel very strongly about it but um we can also see the lighter side of things so mm. for cooks collective and insider club members join us on the closed facebook page or live stream on the cooks mm -hmm. collective for uh, at 2 p.m. this afternoon, Western Standard Time. Yeah. Thank you so much for coming You're in. You're welcome. Thanks Absolutely for having brilliant. me. Can I do it again? Love you lots. Yes, it was awesome. Mm -hmm. Loads of fun. See you. Bye.